All right, let's get started. First, you're going to need to gather some supplies. Um, I was able to find in the art room old magazines, um, some toy catalogs, old calendars, even newspaper. If you can't find any of those at home, feel free to look through recycling. You might be able to do something with um, packaging from food. This is a label from a coffee mug that I just bought. Right, you, what you want to do is look through your house with permission and find something that you can cut an image out of. Um, you're also going to need some scissors, glue or tape if you don't have it, and then some drawing tools. The object for this project is to find an image and cut it out, but then extend an idea on top of that image. So I want to show you a couple of my examples. Here's one, and I found, um, she kind of looks like one of my students, and looks like she's making some art, and I decided, you know what, I'm going to put her in her bedroom, and maybe she is really into art. She loves to stay in her room and create art. Uh, so I drew her on her bed, I cut out some pillows, and then above her, I drew uh, different uh, like paintings or drawings that she created in her bedroom. So what makes this an extended collage is that I cut out an image, which is a girl, and then I extended the idea by adding more to it, my own ideas. And here's her bed, the pillows, and the artwork hanging up. I think in the magazine she was um, sitting and showing different um, toys that you could buy at Target or something. All right, so here's another idea. I don't know if you think you can see this. Here's the body of Elmo, and I cut out and I added a head there. And as soon as I put that together, um, I thought, you know what, maybe I'll put like a band together, a rock band or something. And I was able to find this awesome picture of, of this kid with a guitar, and he looks like he's having a blast. Um, so I kind of made it look like there's a stage here, and I added my symbols of music, so it really gives it kind of emotion, right? So my extended part is I added some um, other pieces to my collage, to the images I added out. And I can go back, and maybe with a Sharpie, maybe they're singing, or I can draw some more band members, or more musical instruments. You can also put this inside of your sketchbook if you don't have any extra paper at home. And this is my um, four-armed four alien eating some, uh, looks like a cup of chili and s'mores, and he's saying, lunchtime. All right, so I have parts from a magazine, and then I extended my idea with my drawing tools by adding my own ideas to it. Right. Here's one that I'm currently working on. found an image of a little girl, and... I thought, you know what, I think she needs an animal head. So I took, I cut off the head, and then I found parts of a giraffe, and now she's kind of like this human slash giraffe. And it needs something else to it. I could draw, maybe she's holding a balloon. Um, I did find, looks like milk and a peep. Maybe they're having a snack, or maybe, because I like the way her hand is, maybe she's bouncing a ball. I know some students in the phys ed are learning how to play basketball. Right? or I can use my drawing tools and add more to it. So let's review for this project your extended collages this week. I'm looking to see if you can cut out images, whether it's from magazines, newspaper, could be um, stuff from recycling, like different food, um, cardboard boxes, packaging, things like that. But make sure you get permission before you start cutting. Um, after you do that, I want to see what you can do with that image. You're going to extend it. So you can extend it with more images. Remember my giraffe head on top of a, a little girl's body. I can extend, maybe they're having a snack in one hand and she's bouncing a ball in the other. She's at a play date. Or you can extend your ideas with some drawing tools, right? Let's also talk about creativity. I'm looking for your own ideas, your original ideas. If you see something in the video that you like, you like one of my ideas, it's okay to borrow it, but don't steal it. <laughs> Borrowing means you maybe you like the idea of someone in their bedroom, but you're really going to change it up. It's not going to have the same objects I drew in the same places. Um, hopefully that makes sense, uh, but I'm really excited to see what you guys do. Um, again, this is an extended collage, and it's still piggybacking on the idea of conscious creativity. I'm really trying to get you guys to think outside the box. And what can you do with images that we see all the time, right? How can we be fun and creative with it and turn it into something totally new? All right, we'll chat soon.